Why is it that butter consumption has decreased by 62% over the last 60 years, yet people are obese and sick? They told you that fat was going to clog your arteries. They're going to, so if you stop eating fat, butter, which is saturated fat, then you shouldn't get clogged arteries and get heart disease and cancer and all these other things, which are at record highs and growing. Okay, here's the thing. <laughs> you can look at data and you can definitely make correlations. This is a correlation. We've had less butter consumption, yet people are sicker than ever. We've had less meat consumption, yet people are sicker than ever. We have more carb, processed food, grains, and seed oil consumption, and people are sicker than ever. You can draw some pretty reasonable inferences from this. You don't need some guy in a lab coat to go test on some rats or to send out a thousand surveys to people and ask them questions about their diet over the last six months to be considered research so that you can then make a decision for yourself about your health. Just look at the data and use common sense. Why is it that grandmas and grandpas and tons, like billions of humans over the last however many years we've been milking cows and sheep and making butter out of it, probably like 5,000 years or more? Why were all those people fit I mean, some were fit, but they were lean. They weren't metabolically deranged. Ask yourself that question and then think about the modern environment today and you'll have the answer.